Christ. Right, you, know what, right, you know what John right, yeah. Wayne's name was? Uh, no, I don't. What is real name? Wayne what John. is real name? <laughs> I don't know what. Marion. Marion no, Robert Morrison. Marion Wayans? Morris. Marion Morrison, which, by the way, is an awesome name, too. Marion Morrison. Marion Morrison. Yeah, but not as awesome as John Wayne. Wayne. Yeah. I'm surprised he didn't go with just the Robert Morrison. Mm -hmm. But I guess if John Wayne's on the table, you're going to take that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Did, now, did those guys, they, did, like, did he come up with that himself? Was he like, I feel like I'm a John Wayne type? I don't know. That's not good. That's right. That's how he did it. It's like some studio guys back in the day. He's like, listen, yeah. here, we're going to call you this. You know, you're yeah. going to do 10 pictures for us. Yeah. And then, uh, <laughs> but I like the idea that- we we'll pay you $1,000. That Marion Morrison <laughs> sounded too ethnic. That was the thing. They wanted to what? make everything seem as like waspy as possible. Like- John Wayne just feels like an American. You know, uh -huh. they were like, no Jews, no Irish, no Italians. Like, let's just keep it like right down the middle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can be those things, but your name can't indicate as much. Yes. Right. Fox Studio Chief Winfield Sheehan rejected the, his name as it sounded too Italian. And then uh -huh. a director, Raul Walsh, Walsh who cast John, John Wayne and stuff, um, suggested John Wayne uh, because it sounded more... L less Italian, I guess. Mm. Kind of makes mm. John Wayne seem like a little bit of a pussy, doesn't it? <laughs> right? Didn't stand he up for his down Italian from that. Name. He didn't stand up for his own yeah. name, his own heritage. He could have said, God damn it, I'm Marion Morrison, and that's all there is to it. Mm -hmm. You know, and instead mm -hmm. he was like, I'll do whatever you say, <laughs> boss. <laughs> Fucking John. Yeah. That's not the John Wayne yeah. I know and remember. Yeah, yeah. He was an actor. Um, uh, yeah. I used to do Shakespeare. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> do I sing and dance in this picture or not? Just How did the... John Wayne become an actor? Did he start in the? Did he start? Was he doing? He plays? was. An, he, he went to USC, which is odd. And did he, he play football? Yeah, he was. A, he was. A, yeah. He was an athlete. Okay, that sounds right. He was huge. He was like six five or something. Six right. four, six five. Right. And he was an athlete. And then he was injured and lost his athletic scholarship and had to leave the university. But he broke his collarbone, which as we all know, is a really cool injury. That's mm -hmm. pretty fucking sweet, dude. <laughs> Yeah, did he do it? One. Did he do it shredding? <laughs> was he shredding? Was it, what was he, he shredding? Did it, uh, was he shredding? In a body arm? surfing accident, it says. Body Wait, what? So he was shredding. He was shredding, he was he was shredding. shredding. He was shredding water. <laughs> wow, that's pretty yeah. cool. Wait, yeah. wait, John. Wait, sorry. Who broke his? Cut? I'm getting John lost here. Wayne. Um, Mar sorry, Marion Morrison. Yes, mm -hmm. when uh -huh. he was uh -huh. attending USC. Uh -huh. um, had a broken collarbone, which curtailed his athletic career. He later noted that he was too terrified of Jones, who was his coach at the time, uh, of Jones's reaction to reveal the actual cause of his injury, a body surfing accident. Do, why was that? It's like a pansy sport no. back then, wasn't it? Yeah. I mean, I think it was probably like, you shouldn't be doing dangerous things instead of you playing football. You can't be shredding gnar yeah. when we yeah. need you out here. This guy shredding, shredding, body shredding bones. Not really that fucking you dangerous. You can't take on a, doing it off the ocean coast of wave. Australia. How are you going to take on the UCLA football team? That's right. You know, like, let's, the Crimson Tide. How do you break your collar? But, do you think he's body surfing with his arms <laughs> behind well, him? Let me tell you, man. Fucking, <laughs> if you're out like Zoom the Beach... You're at like Zuma Beach, and those things are breaking right into the shore. Those waves man. in it's Venice, crazy. they break. shore break. Yeah. It's, it's a shore, shore break situation. It's a heavy pitch, bra. <laughs> bra, yeah, bra. <laughs> bra. That's, that's how John. That's how Marion Morrison used to talk. Yeah, it's like, dude, dude, dude. What? <laughs> I was fucking shredded and fucking I was shredding sea gnar, ocean gnar, okay? okay? I was totally shredding ocean gnar, and I was like, let me do one where my hands aren't here, but they're like here, dude. I thought it was and my buddy was like, dude, bra. there's a crazy fucking shore break, Marion. You shouldn't do it, bro. <laughs> Marion, you should not be in this wave, bro. Mar Mar Marion, this is not your wave, bro. <laughs> And Marion was like, fuck that, dude. Ain't no puss. And then he uh, fucking shredded it. And sure enough, snapped his car. Oh, was damn. Like, what am I going to do now? I can't even be an actor. I sound too Italiano. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's going to think I'm Italian, dude. <laughs> fuck. So I can't play football. I can't play in the movies. Italians will never thrive in movie pictures. <laughs> I'm feeling jazzed now. Me too. Like it was a breakthrough week of just, you know, I think just kind of something to the grindstone. Yeah. What, do put, what do you put? Your, your nose? Axe. Your axe nose. to the grindstone. I think you put your nose to the grindstone. 
Nose why, why the fuck the would you put your nose it's to not a, a good grindstone? Idea. I know. It's not a good idea. Well, yeah. it acts to the grindstone, doesn't that oh, yeah, sharpen it? Sharpens it. it. Yeah, but, it, but for whatever reason, I think it's nose. You, you no, know, you have an axe to, to grind, but you put your nose to the grindstone. Yeah. There you go. Why would I you think want to grind your nose? Your, your head's Miller's, down and you're your just grinding. Down and you're, you're not up looking around like, I'd love to grind some other things. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? I want to grind my own know, I'd like to grind that night over there. You're like, I'd like to grind this stone. And with my like to grind um, my sword on the stone? I don't Where does I it come from? Says, What's um, two rival explanations. One is that it comes from the supposed habit of millers who checked that the stones used for grinding cereal weren't overheating by putting their nose to the oh, stone in order to like smell any burning. It's like kissing a baby's forehead to see if they have a fever. Yeah. But that's not about working that's hard. Working you know, hard. that's just like smelling your work well, every now and then. I've gone back and watched all of those early UFC events. All of them. I've seen ev every one. The first... 20. Where does this man find the time? What, what, if, I, if I'm working out or something like that, it's a good thing to pop on. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. You've got UFC in the background while you're working out and you're actually paying attention. You're like, that's that's Don Fry. I've been doing a set. <laughs> I get that. I yeah. get that. It's just yeah, on. It's you don't have to watch like, you know, you can, it's not like a, yeah. a film with subtitles. You can look away from the screen. Yeah. Just looking up and you're like, oh, you've seen some sweaty men and you're turning yourself into a sweaty man <laughs> and you're seeing another sweaty man. And then, <laughs> you're not going to be sweaty like and him. And you're like, how can I get drive? sweatier? And then you're... <laughs> Watching another man, you're saying, well, if there was another man in here for me to press against, that would be exciting. <laughs> and then, I don't know. It's worth hear. having uh, Meg, uh, when she comes back to work, um, mm -hmm. put up some of that UFC footage from an early fight. There was, a, there was one in particular I'm thinking of with this guy named uh, Joe San. And Joe San was on the ground, and there was a guy that he was fighting who was just pounding on his dick. Just, just pounding on it. I mean, just pounding on it until eventually he tapped from groin strikes. I yeah, believe. yeah. That, that was legal. That would be an amazing thing too, if like if that was like your signature move. You know what I mean? Like just just yeah. like pounding dick. Yeah, yeah, just pounding dicks. You know, in the ring. I was alone in the hotel. And I, I hit a certain point where I was like, I'm just so bored and the TV's not working. And I had a link to Glenn's movie. And I know we're going to save it. We're going to watch it. Save it. it. We're going to save, save it. Save I'll it. save it. I'll save it. Save uh oh. It. Have you watched it? I'm going to watch it uh, tonight, right? Because okay. we're talking tomorrow. All we're right. talking Friday about it. <sighs> Strap in. I can't wait. I can't well, wait. Well, uh, I, I, I can't I, wait to talk about it. It seems like what you're saying is that you enjoyed it and you enjoyed my performance. So I appreciate it. That fills me up. You're filling me up right now. Okay. I love it when you fill me up. Okay, good. Uh, we'll just nothing ready. better than being filled up by your friends. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right? Getting filled up. Yeah. And fill, plugging those holes. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Plugging those God holes. Get ready and filling to get us up. filled to the brim. <laughs> Describe the feeling of winning the league, of trying to do it, and like, and how does it compare to other other feelings that you've had? Yes, thank you. Uh, fair question. Um, you guys still have feelings? There is a... There is a moment. I don't know, I'm assuming that the, the moment that we actually won the game. Uh, I don't remember it all. I kind of blacked out. I went uh, because you know. Yeah, it looked like it, you and Ryan almost fell over the balcony. Yes, like simultaneously. And I, and I didn't. And I didn't. <laughs> I didn't know that until I until Paul because Paul Rudd shot that because he was right behind us and he showed us that video and you see both of us at the same time almost like co collapse in unison yeah something you guys left kinda... our bodies uh -huh. um and i don't remember doing that at all and he, neither does he maybe do... something entered your bodies from the back <laughs> <laughs> just and, just and just consider you it. forward just consider it that's yeah. what i mean like in, as opposed to something pulling out of your body and pushing you forward there could have been something that entered you just to be clear, no sexual harassment and falling in love with someone that you work with, no. even if you're their boss and they're below you, sexual harassment would come in if either of you said mm -hmm. no, and then the other one like tormented you at work. Because well, of it. That's, oh, well, hold on, well, hold on, no, on hang a second, on, hang on. because that is exactly what happened. <laughs> that's not... Well, okay. I did I not rebuff your advances? <laughs> it's only harassment if it doesn't lead to marriage and children. Yeah, that's, that's right. Thank Fair. You. Let's yeah, just yeah. leave it. But at that. there was a next, period of next, time in next. which it. I was telling Miles how, like, back in the day when you called someone's house, like you had to like talk to their parents and be like, "Hey, can I talk yeah, to so and so?" Yes. You know. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and he's like, "That's awkward." I'm like, "Yeah, well, want to <laughs> yes. hear it awkward?" My dad mm -hmm. answered the phone once. He's like, "Hello," and the person was like, "Is Jill there?" And he's like, "Yeah, hold on a second. And put the phone to his ass and farted in it. And it was my boyfriend. <laughs> wow. It was my boyfriend. Wow. 
boyfriend. Was. So this was like a move he did. I guess he yeah, thought it was hilarious strange. to make these. Yeah, so when look, you brought if I find home, these guys you, and yeah. they stick around, there's a good man. Yeah. But, 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 he's a good, <laughs> but if, they laugh, if, if they think this is funny, then yeah. they're a keeper. I don't know. Uh, well, yeah. so, so if but, they're offended by my casual flatulence, <laughs> uh, you know, they're not going to make it in this family. But if I can blast ass all over this guy, he's cool. I was temping at my dad's insurance company in New York <laughs> and was wearing a dress shirt that was way too big. Uh, and when I went to use the bathroom, probably after lunch, uh, I didn't realize that once I sat down on the toilet that the shirt was so big that it had created a hammock that completely <laughs> didn't allow like a, like anything to reach the water. So when I finished pooping, <laughs> I looked down and saw my a- dress shirt was just perfectly cradling a shit. Uh, <laughs> Which was a real situation. Because <laughs> so I was in New York. I live in New Jersey. I didn't have like a, a uh, different pair of clothing. New store, so you went and bought a new shirt, right? <laughs> <laughs> that would have been the smart thing to do. No, no, I took off my shirt and was probably just bare chested, just scrubbing poop out of yeah, my I shirt and then wore right. it for the rest of the day. Yeah. Um, Can we stop down to talk about the name Liverpool for a second? Is it a pool full of livers? Is it, I think is it's it a, like something pooling up in your liver? That's what I think it is. It's, yeah. It's alcohol. It's alcohol and it's yeah. pooled up in your liver. Yeah, and okay, it's a town. I got, I got a question for you. What the, the, if you're from Liverpool, mm-hmm. you were called a Liverpudlian, wh- or so a Liverpudlian, which is the strangest, thing. <laughs> crazy Liverpudlian. <laughs> yeah. right. So the and pool you know turned for... into a puddle. Yeah, <laughs> a Liverpudlian. <laughs> Somehow the pool got smaller. A... The pool turned into a puddle. I guess. <laughs> why? Why would you be? Yeah. A, why yeah. wouldn't you be a Liverpoolian? A Liverpondian, um, which sounds. Sort of alien, yeah. but Liverpudlian doesn't sound that much less alien. So yes. yeah, it's a good. So point. you're either a Liverpudlian or something a else. Scouser. Oh, what? that I would never. Have yeah, guessed. say okay. what? Scouser. You're scouse. If yeah. You're, if you're like uh, they say, scouse. I'm, well, why? With a scouse, a scouser. Accent. Uh, that also Don't sounds know. like something that some, my pool guy would do, right? Liverpool, uh-huh. Liverpuddle, like a, that a scouser would come in and get the bottom of the pool. Scouse the pool. <laughs> you got to scouse the pool every yeah, so often yeah, to get yeah. the algae scouse off. Scouse all the. Yeah. Liver pipes that are on the top of the pool just yeah, swimming the liver around. Pi- yeah. I remember you used to call a restaurant from Sunny, you used to call La Dijonese, and you would ask them what their soup of the day was, which they would give, and then you would ask them what their smell of the day was, and the person would lose their minds because you would do it every day to them. <laughs> and then it'd be like, God damn it, <laughs> like, like, he, me, he got me again. Like, you just hear that. Don't call it anymore. <laughs> and your smell of the day. Ah! Hear the person go crazy. <laughs> You introduced me to a, a something called Feel Free, which Sorry is just an over-the-counter supplement, which I thought was like, you know, like an energy drink or something like that. And it, mm-hmm. it turns out it just gets you high. Wow. wow. It gives you something. Whatever it gives you. A little bit yeah. of a high. I thought, well, I feel free. It, uh, I'll, I'll drink one of these to feel free instead of, instead of the Manhattan at night, sure. just to have something, you know. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. It was fine, but I didn't feel better. And so... Then I thought, well, what if I just have a second feel free? Now you're not supposed to do that. No, you're not. That's exceeding the. Uh, that's too free. That's too. That's too free. <laughs> J- just to be clear, I I didn't. I was not. So I was not coming down on you about. In fact, I praised Don't go down you. On me. I pra- I praised <laughs> you for how much time, effort, and energy you put into lots of things. Mm-hmm. All I was suggesting was that. <laughs> It was. It's fascinating how you will go from zero to ten on something, and then three weeks later, when di- when new information comes out, you go zero to ten in the opposite direction. I haven't done that in a long time. I know, but I was pointing. I was pointing back in the past where that happened. Yeah, That's all. I was a passionate young man. You know, <laughs> That's passionate all. about my health. We're all trying new things, and I and I think that's admirable. Like mm. if you came in and said, "I'm doing this weird thing. I'm trying it." I don't know if it's going to work, like, but I'm reading all this interesting science about it, and people have been fasting for thousands of years, and I don't know. I'll, I'm going to give it a shot. Yeah, we'd be like, oh, okay, right. It was more, and back me up, so that I'm not out on a limb here. It was more that you came in and you were like, this, this is this is going to work, and if you guys, and the implication was, if you guys eat something today. That's crazy. You shouldn't be eating. Now, see, that was you getting defensive and thinking that I was judging you on what you were eating. And I wasn't. Come um, on. I, I think that, Come okay, on. here's how I'll, I'll back you up. The, oh, fuck, man. Like, you're, you're, you're the one, like, you're accusing me of getting defensive. You're the one. Like, I never said shit about what you were eating. 
And I was you, doing my thing, no, and but, you were constantly but, commenting do, on do it. Do you understand? Do, can you can you step outside of how upset you are right now, and just can you understand what thing. it is? You're fucking to gaslighting the shit out of no, me. No, no, right I'm really not. I'm He's really gaslighting not. me. I'm are just trying this? to get you to see. You're see fucking gaslighting me. I'm, I'm really Charlie, not. get in there. I'm really. Uh, not. I'm a little lost, <laughs> but that's what happens <laughs> so only because. Yeah, you don't yeah. watch the podcast, then, is what I'm learning. No. Yeah. I mean, how much of a narcissist? I mean, I'm just going to sit back and watch the podcast. Qu- quality watch control. Yourself. Quality control. QC. I yeah, trust QC. Megan and nice. Mara and our entire yeah. team, really. I mean. Mm-hmm. Um, well, that's foolish because, you know. Because <laughs> you're coming off terrible. You're coming off real bad. <laughs> yeah, real, real Coming bad. off like a real douche. Yeah. Yeah. Um, that no, uh, sometimes I do. Maybe that's sometimes why I don't, I don't. Like to listen to it. Have Rob and Glenn and I changed a lot? Is it, is it different? Oh, that's things? a great question. I mean, uh, Rob, you still, guys are my Rob still drives that pickup truck. Rob, <laughs> uh, yeah. I, there's been a lot of changes. I would say you have changed the least by far. Yeah. Everyone yeah. remains the same person and the same person you're talking to. So that's great. Rob is, uh, it, you know, he's gotten into science. He's he's gotten into companies. Uh, Glenn yeah. is on the forefront he's a, he's of nutrition of and houses. And yeah. I still just want to tell good jokes. I just want. I just want to. He's, you, you're a simple man. I Let's eat stickers that. all the time. Was that an improv on the day, or was De- that in the def- I can't remember. Definitely, we fought about that in the in, yes, in the editing did. room. Yes, we did because you were we we both were on the same page where you're like, yeah. uh, I thought it was funny. Yeah, because you improv. I yeah. eat stickers all the time, and you were like, that is the dumbest thing I've ever heard. We're now we're mean? establishing like, that, that mean? Charlie eats stickers all the time, and we're like, yeah. yes, okay, yeah. good. You guys remember that too? Oh yeah, yeah. Look, I'll, I'll fully admit that that there's they're just. And everybody's got a line, right? Everybody's got a line. What about now? Is the sticker thing funny to you now? No. Nope. Did you find it? No. So not not that like funny. It. But yeah. I can appreciate why. I, I understand why other people think it's funny. Uh, I just don't think it's that funny. I mean, I think- You don't would, buy that the guy would eat stickers all the time? No. I buy that you would have eaten the sticker on the pear and that that it tasted awful and that you ate the stem and the seeds and all that kind of shit because mm-hmm. you don't know how to eat a pear. Like, I, I mm-hmm. somehow that's okay with me, but- mm-hmm. Uh, this is the one step past. The it's the one the step past where you say, like, I eat stickers all the time. That means that means you're a man who looks at a sticker and goes, I'm going to eat that. Yeah, probably just like a scratch and sniff sticker. But yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, well, see, they, now they that smell so good. Yeah. So that additional line, what about a back for you? If he was like, what are you talking about? Like, you scratch, you sniff, you taste. You scratch, you sniff. <laughs> it's like, you're... it's just scratch and sniff. Yeah. <laughs> Since when? <laughs> it's scratch, sniff, and taste. Scratch, sniff, and taste. The ones That's on right. the bananas do taste like bananas. <laughs> Do you remember the amount of conversations about the Cheeto fingers on the wall? Oh, oh wait. We were, sp- I believe that this is a product that integration. A product oh, integration. yes, it is. It oh and my Cheetos is a product Cheetos integration. Oh. wanted the, like, loved the Cheeto finger thing. Like, they wanted it, right? Wasn't that a big thing where they were like, I think it was the opposite. It was that they didn't want, <laughs> they, that was what they didn't want. It was, I, was like, that's the one thing about that our That makes product. more sense. But for some yeah. reason, I remember them being like, and if you could really talk about the Cheeto fingers. But <laughs> maybe, <laughs> maybe. When you're shooting something, you have to worry about content, something called continuity. And I don't know if everybody knows what continuity is, but basically, like, you know, if you're if you're in a scene and and let's just say you've got a thing where you have to, you know, something spills out of your mouth and all over your shirt. Why don't you continue this conversation, but halfway through, take your hat off, continue it, and then put your hat back on, then continue it, and then just cut back and forth, and then we'll show people what continuity is. Yeah, yeah. yeah so if, if take one, you know, if take one, you're you're wearing a hat, you know, mm-hmm. and then suddenly you go take, to lunch, you come back, you forget you're wearing a hat. In the you scene. go to lunch, you come back, you mm-hmm. get, you're still shooting the same scene. You come back, somebody, you know, somebody forgot to put the hat back on you. All of a sudden, you uh-huh. know, some takes you got the hat on, some so takes some, you got the hat on. And sometimes you're talking to the person, and then and then you cut back to the other person to see what their response is. And the next thing you know, they're wearing a hat again. Yeah, <laughs> and then it's yeah. just super weird. Mm-hmm. You know, like it it doesn't cut together. You well, have there is a point in time out. where you can mm-hmm. get away with a pretty bad lack of continuity, yeah. and I think that's when the energy of the performance is yeah. so interesting and engaging. You'll yeah. see that in like a Scorsese movie where uh-huh. you'd be like, oh wow, that just. There's a lack of continuity and like Goodfellas or something. And then yeah, it drives me crazy. Not quite hats off, hats on. There are some continuity things that are like too far, but sometimes you just gotta, you you gotta get the continuity continuity today. And like, sometimes you just don't know like why or when something happened. You're like, how will have that? So this is for, and then it feels like it doesn't make sense because you're not, 
you're not sucked into the reality of what's happening. Yeah. You're actually like pushed directly. Sure. Yeah, it kind of takes you out of it, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah, it takes you out of it because yeah. you're like, you're like, wait, I swear, you know, that's what you don't want, right? You're doing, you're in, you're actually having a really good scene, like you said, and then the next mm-hmm. thing you know, you're like, wait, was did he have that? Didn't he have a hat on before? Or did he? Mm-hmm. But it is amazing that how you will not notice it if the scene is good enough and it's mm-hmm. compelling enough to Meg's point where you're looking yeah, at you somebody's, you. you're looking at somebody's <laughs> face and. Not, like we're having and, fun and, with continuity today. And not yeah, paying yeah, attention. Props. <laughs> yeah. No, I know. It's just, it's just it's weird. And and that's what you don't want, you know, because it, it will take you out. I don't want to jump and like look awkward. Right. You just don't want to be strange. <laughs> the shoulders up. <laughs> the jacket. For the, for the Wait, listeners, we did a bit where we just kept. Oh, uh, that's right. The listeners won't get it. Yeah, the listeners won't Fuck get it. it. They My biggest laugh is when Danny anyone? first lifts up the the tent and the amount of smoke that comes <laughs> out from under it. I had forgotten about, and I, yeah. it He's caught like, me oh. off guard. He was so big. My, <laughs> mine was uh, so quick, which was just you. Charlie handing Dennis papers he doesn't need. Oh, yeah. I laughed every time you did that. I, I clearly laugh towards the very end. Yeah, and the second time, the that, second round of that. Yeah, yeah right at the very end. You I totally hand one to you, and, and <laughs> your reaction gets me, and I have to look down because I'm laughing. I love it because we play it so, I, I'm trying to play it so yeah. real. Well, the reason I was, <laughs> it's a good bit, yeah, but it's also one of those so things funny. where like, it wasn't hard for me to play it real because you didn't tell me you were going to do that. Oh. You just started doing it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So it was actually mildly irritating to me. <laughs> like I knew it was funny, but like, but I'm I'm trying to remember my lines. I'm trying to do my lines, and you're you're you know handing me papers. And uh, so it was actually like, yeah. So I just kind of leaned into the like whatever little bit of it was actually kind of yeah. irritating to me. I just, Which I probably picked up on and then yeah, did it more. It. <laughs> yeah. Um, you parsed and then it you out would though. Switch a paper with a different paper. And then <laughs> yeah, right, right. Perhaps you want this one. Perhaps, perhaps you perhaps want this one. These notes you need. <laughs> <laughs> that was still at a time where I think we could shoot and we wouldn't draw a huge crowd, right? Not yeah. 2000, yeah, season five, not yet, right? Yeah, we could still get away with it. Although I do remember people yelling to Danny when we were driving around the okay, block. Okay, yes. But when we hit the guy with the, with the, by the way, the stunt guy nailed it going over yeah. the uh, bike. Yeah, he and, sure did. And we'll, start, sh- we'll start that from the beginning because that was a really fun moment in the shooting of the show that we reference a lot because it was very specific. We were going around a big loop. So when we were shooting, we would just, because I had to throw it at that guy's head and I think I missed like three times, but we had to do this giant loop around this one neighborhood in mm. Philly where we would just go yeah. up and down the street and we're passing the same houses and the same people. And no one knew our show, including people in Philadelphia, but everybody knows Danny. So the neighbors were out on their stoops and every time we would pass by, they mm-hmm. would yell out at hey, us. Hey, Danny. Hey, Danny, come on over, Danny. Yeah. I'll make you some ziti. And then we'd be passing yeah, and then yeah. we'd turn around, we'd come back around. And then <laughs> um, just more and more hey, people. Hey, Danny. Yeah. And we had a joke, running joke in the car about it getting more extreme. Like, oh, Danny, come over and let me tie you up in the basement for a few <laughs> Danny, hours. Danny, let John. me wear your face, Dan. <laughs> Danny, I got a spot only the- take off the foot. Come here, Danny. Danny, just a little piece of your body Danny, for the basement for the trophy over. room. Danny. <laughs> Danny, I'll bake you into a CD. Come here, Danny. <laughs> Danny, can we eat you for dinner yeah. tonight? Danny. <laughs> yeah. 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 Everybody wanted a piece. Everybody yeah, wanted, wanted a piece of Danny. Yeah. Piece of Danny. Have you ever seen a dead person up close? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Yes. I, I, honestly, okay. like once. Besides, in like, a more good, not great. I was a kid in. I was go, an altar boy. Okay, this is yeah. a good one. Uh, and I used to do the. There was a six o'clock mass, six thirty mass, and you'd fight over it because who the hell wants to get up at six o'clock and go do the altar? Well, you want to? So I get to six thirty mass one day for my friend who's doing the six o'clock mass. I got there a little early, freezing cold, New Jersey. Five, maybe four or five old ladies in the big church for the six o'clock mass, right? I go early. I go into the one of the front pews. I I sit there and watch. They're finishing the mass. All of a sudden, I hear a thud. And I look over, and there's a dead lady right there, right here, like right where you are, looking up at me with her eyes open. Oh, my God. It was scary as shit. <laughs> the face and, I, just made it. <laughs> and I go, oh, oh, oh. Now I don't know what's it. Was it like do. a knife and, and a note? Like what happened? <laughs> there was no. 
If you were the one who saw an alien spacecraft like about to land and you had the ability to either shoot it out of the sky or let it land, what would you pick? Well, I I mean, well, definitely let it land. You got to let it land, right? You're responsible for the complete destruction of humanity as we know it because it was the evolution. If it's figured out how to fly here, it's going to be super. Yeah, there's more more where it came from. Yeah, it's right. Yeah, but we figured out how to fly there. It's up to no good. We're not that smart. What if he's just here on a on vacation? What if he's just here to fucking body surf? What if he just wants to body surf Nar, dude? Ocean Nar. Oh man. If I had a collarbone, I would have just broken it. <laughs> <laughs> Good thing I'm mostly liquid. Yeah. Yeah. I have a collar yeah. spot. <laughs> so you and Rob had the top floor of that. Of that we building. had, yeah. And yeah. jacuzzi on the roof. Yeah. With the jacuzzi on the roof. Uh-huh. It was pretty oh, bachelor patty. Yeah, it was very yeah you got taken patty. back to that apartment with a yeah. jacuzzi on the roof. And yes. you were like, uh-huh. well, you were, I guess you were in the place. You're like, well, this isn't going to be a long term yeah. thing. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 With party at boy. that yeah. age, like jacuzzi on the roof is not a red flag. Sure, at that sure, age, sure. jacuzzi it's is like, like you can cool. afford a jacuzzi. <laughs> yeah, right. You know, like, like wow, how do you what? pay for the water? How'd you get it on the yeah. roof? Yeah, 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 get yeah, on the roof. On the roof. By they the way, craned it on the I, roof. We craned it onto the roof. If, if anyone's interested, yeah. <laughs> if you're interested on how to we do that. We literally had to get a crane. You got you were like Mac and Dennis craning a hot tub <laughs> onto a roof. <laughs> <laughs> we, first of all, first of all, picture Rob and I hot tub shopping. Oh, which we did. That, that was the first amazing. step. The first step was going to the hot tub place on Sepulveda, and 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 looking amazing. and looking at various models and, and discussing you know, the pros and cons of the different you, shapes and yes, colors. Yes, and exactly. Who's gonna yes. sit where? And uh, Glenn, let's um, pack right now. If we have a quick midlife crisis, let's get an apartment <laughs> and with a jacuzzi on the roof. Be a lot sadder now. Be a lot um, sadder. <laughs> <laughs> the three of you guys in an apartment with a jacuzzi. We'd on be room. going in to, to soak the things that hurt. You know, that's a whole different be motivation for being on that roof. Yeah. Yeah. God, just everything hurts. Everything hurts. Want to get up at the tub, bro? Yeah, yeah. yeah let's do Rob's it. in an ice bath. <laughs> That season yeah, had that great. super funny thing with Pat. With uh, he was pitching something, and I don't. Did you do it? I, I did it. He was wearing a hoodie. And he was pitching something, and Roselle just reached over and unzipped the hoodie, and we saw that he wasn't wearing a shirt. He was just <laughs> wearing a hoodie, and he was suddenly just bare-chested, <laughs> completely <laughs> deflated the pitch, and everyone's like, who wears just like, a hoodie, man? <laughs> not unlike Glenn with the cereal in the car, dug in that oh, there was man. nothing weird about wearing a zip-up hoodie. Maybe he crapped in his shirt in the Right, oh, man. He had to put on his, yeah. No, but that was, to do that in a writer's room. Dug in on, why is this weird? It's just his, you Wear a zipper with no fabric underneath of it. Yeah. yeah. That derailed the room for like an hour. <laughs> <laughs> like, you came to a writer's room. We're not a nice crowd. Like, you yeah, know, you do, yeah, yeah. do something be, off kilter, you're going to get picked there. apart. This is the dating profile scene, a simple scene. Okay. You guys are just coming over yeah. uh, to put me on a dating website, and I am a strange man, and <laughs> it doesn't go well. Yep. All right. Um, okay. So, Charlie. Uh, yeah. We're going to get you back on the dating scene, bro. What do you think about that? Yeah, no, no, that's actually why we're here. We want to put your profile mm-hmm. okay. on Match.com. Uh, okay, well, I don't see why. I mean, I got the waitress, so. Yeah, right. Yeah, uh, sure. But, yeah. you know, uh, yeah. totally. But, you know, we yeah. we thought, um, you know, you know, we think that you could meet somebody new. Yeah, someone you like even uh, more than the waitress. Yeah. Uh, I don't really see how that's possible, but... Um, all right, tell you what, uh, you know what? Let me pop a quick H on this box. Uh, that way we all know it's full of hornets and stuff. So it'll have an H on it. Okay. Well, yeah, no, do what yeah. you got to do. And okay. then we'll uh, we'll get started. Yeah. All yeah. right. Good to go. Okay. <laughs> These things sting like a bitch. So you want to have an H on there. <laughs> yeah, you sure <laughs> do. Yeah, they are hornets. So you're going to get that's stung. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Watch out for well, that box with a B on it. What is that? Those are, Those are just bees. bees yeah. Yeah. Right. I should have put that together. Okay. All right. Well, listen, uh, let's get yeah. to it. All right. First thing we got to do, we got to, we, we, do, we need to take your picture for the profile. Uh, so, yeah. So, uh, do you have the makeup? Uh, yeah. Uh, yes. Uh, yeah. Let's, yeah. let's cover this up here. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, I don't know. Come on. No makeup, guys. Well, no, man, well you know. no, those hornet stings are pretty, they're pretty bad, buddy. So, I think yeah, we got to have to. Mm. Right, but let's do who you are minus the hornet stings. Yeah, mm. like let, let's pretend like you're not who you are, and mm. just try to attract a woman. Yeah, right. ooh. I th- oh, okay. I tell you what, should I get? I'll get like a checkered hat and a pipe, and like that would work. What? Why? Why? Why, why would you want a, a checkered hat? I don't understand. Pipe? What is that for? Why? The Sherlock Holmes look. You know how he always he has like a checkered hat. He has like a little. Yeah. No. I okay. Pipe. Not a cob pipe. Not a cheap pipe. Like a nice pipe. A nice one. 
Yeah. Well, why uh-huh. would you want to look like Sherlock Holmes? Like, what? What to is that? To attract really? intelligent women. Okay, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to take a, a yeah. photo right now without the makeup. Yeah. We'll see if he snag okay. that photo. We'll see if he, right, we'll see if he likes that. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, <laughs> yes. Was that yeah. sexy? Um, was that sexy? Oh, you know what? <laughs> you know, um, <laughs> We'll Photoshop it. <laughs> yeah, you I'm know just what? We'll, photogenic. Yeah, we'll we'll deal with that later. Yeah, um, was that a good yeah, one? We'll fix some post. We'll okay. Yeah. Post. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. We're gonna. We'll it just felt like a good one. It felt sexy. I, I felt can like see. I can see where this is headed. So yeah. let's just let's not do that right you now. Want me to take another one? No. Or? No. I don't yeah. think so. No. You got a good one? No. 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 I, right. Well, we got one. We got Let's one. Let's good start then. Okay. We'll we'll, we'll, we'll find another picture. Great. Yeah, 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 and yeah, that'll yeah. be fine. Yeah. Let's talk about let's talk about your likes and dislikes. Sure. What, what's your yeah. what, what's your favorite food, oh, for instance? Steak, what would that for be? sure? Definitely milk steak. <laughs> hmm? huh? What? Huh? Milk uh milk steak, you know. I'm not putting milk steak. Just, just what like, even is that? Yeah, put, just, milk, just put, put steak. Just put regular steak. Uh, yeah, well, I don't, don't know what a milk. Put regular steak. steak. You put milk steak. Otherwise, she's not going to know what it is. No, no, she won't know what it is. Nobody knows what that is. <laughs> uh, okay, milk okay. steak. No, it no, no, no. Perfectly no. clear. I don't know how. No, yeah. it sounds it's, clear, but nobody knows what it is because it's not a thing. Okay, don't, all right. Don't, yeah, don't. All right. It. Let's. What's What's your favorite hobby? Uh, magnets. Okay. Uh, what like like making magnets, collecting magnets, yeah, I don't know, just, just pl- magnets. You know, like regular magnet stuff. No, I know what a magnet is. I'm just saying, what do you, you know do how with they them? Stick or like sometimes they push each other away from each other. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna put snowboarding. We'll, yeah. we'll put. Uh, let's put snowboarding. I don't Sounds really cool. snowboard, but okay. <sighs> how do you magnet? I you mean, st- you stick them or you push them apart from one another. And that's your hobby. Yeah. I don't think I've ever seen him. I've never seen him. Okay, all right. I've seen him eat a magnet. Yeah, I, I don't do. You know, I don't like try to show off and do it all the time in front of you guys. Show off. Okay, right. listen. Let's move past that. Um, uh, why don't we? What, what are some of your likes? Oh, ghouls, for bitch. sure. Okay, go. Cool. What are you talking? What are you talking about, about now? Ghouls, cool. like little, you know, little, little green ghouls, like you know, funny little. Like little green ghouls, ghouls. Like, like in movies, like in cartoons. What about ghouls? Little, little green ghouls? I know what you're talking. Don't write ghouls. <laughs> I'm not gonna write ghouls. I'm not writing it. I'm putting travel. Jesus Christ! I don't travel. I don't like travel. Oh, what like are your ghouls. dislikes? I want a girl who likes school. Uh, people's knees, dude. Come, you, come on, on, dude. You, you cover got, your knees up if you're gonna be walking around everywhere. I don't want to see fun. people's knees. Just, what is it? Let's okay. Just you know what? We're, we'll, we're gonna we'll make, make the whole it, thing. We'll up. Make it let's all just get out of here. Make it let's make it all up. No, we can't do this. Okay. Sorry, we're okay. not even gonna. Yeah. We're not even gonna use you for this. Yeah, we got the we got the picture. All we're right, but you're not gonna get a cool chick if she, if you know you're not putting all my cool things down. And that's cover your knees up if you're cover your knees up if you're, you're walking, walking around, around the world. I do think you guys should do the scene just because it's so iconic. The fans love it. Okay. That's, that's the fans right. love do it. Let's do it for the fans. Okay. Perfect. All right. Hello. Yo. Uh, where you been? Uh, what do you mean, man? I, I, uh, you know what? Actually, why don't you guys switch? So then that way, we can just cut between these two cameras. You know, because my looks to him aren't gonna be good. <laughs> you know, he didn't like that. My looks to him aren't gonna be good. You know what I mean? Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> he didn't like that. He didn't like that. Okay, he's don't, gonna text my, me about it later. Tell me don't feel. Good. I'm, oh, no. oh. I'm sorry, Charles. Take a big crap. Here's your water. <laughs> Here's your water. <laughs> All right, here we go. All right. Hello. Hey. Uh, yo. Where Where you been? Uh, what do you mean? I was getting the movie. Uh, yeah, but you you an- you weren't answering any of my calls. I've been sort of calling you over and over. Uh, yeah, I was having a uh, conversation with the video store clerk. Uh, yeah, but I texted you nine one one, dude. That that means it's an emergency. Yeah, yeah, I saw that. What what was the emergency, Mac? Well, I couldn't get in touch with you, dude. I, I almost called the police. The emergency was you couldn't get in touch with me? I mean, that's a little bit of an over, overreaction, don't you think, man? Yeah. Like, <sighs> what, like uh, I was gone for, what, an hour? I mean... Well, yeah, but I, I thought we had a deal, you know? You, you would check in with me every once in a while, and then that way I would know that you're okay. Oh, okay. Well, all right, well, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm okay. Can we watch the movie? Yeah. <laughs> Great, sure. Okay. All right, good. Transporter <sighs> too. Yeah, yeah. I, I look, man. I, you know, I, I know you wanted to see Predator again, but I feel like, you know, we've seen that like thirty times in the last two months, and I thought maybe we could mix things up. You know, video store clerk guy said that this movie was was awesome. So, the video store clerk guy. I feel like you you won't stop talking about him. <laughs> <laughs> huh. That's a better take, huh? Yeah, that was a good take. We should Very use that sad. one. Very use real. That one. 
Let's use that one. Can Circle we'll it. Use that one. Oh. <laughs> that one. <laughs> and I asked him for a movie recommendation. Okay. I mean, yeah, you got one. <laughs> <laughs> it's really not that big of a deal, dude. Well, like, the big deal, Dennis, is that I wasn't even consulted on the decision. Okay. <laughs> this is a big deal to me as well. You know, it, it's also my night. Plus, Transporter 2, we haven't seen Transporter 1, which means we'll be completely lost. I got it. Plus, Jason Statham's physique is nothing like the lineup okay. in no, Predator. Please, no, will you stop? I don't want to hear conversations anymore about dudes' physiques. Dennis. Just, and whether or not they can— body mass alone. Okay, that, that's— Yes, okay. Yeah, I get it. Okay, can we not— I, That's what I was trying to avoid, okay? Okay. I don't want to have a conversation about body mass, okay? We've had that conversation five times, you know, a day for the last month because we keep watching Predator and all you want to talk about is Weathers and, and you know, Jesse the Body Ventura and how many pounds they can pack on and why that's important. It's important to pack on mass. So we're talking about carbo loading. I don't want, I don't, I don't want to have this conversation. Oh, no, I don't want to have this conversation. I, I just don't, man. Uh, I don't, you had to say, I don't want to have this conversation I don't want to have this anymore. conversation with you anymore, okay? No, you'd rather have it with the video store clerk. You know what, man? I, look, if you don't want to watch the movie with me, that's fine. I'll watch it by myself. God damn. Whoa. Jesus. Where, where, where's this coming from? I guess I, I have been thinking a lot about what D said. And I do think... I do think that maybe we are spending a little too much time. <laughs> <laughs> you, you had it. I know. You had it. You had it. I, just, I do think we're, we're, we are spending a little too much time together. I can't look at you. I can't look at you. Well, what are you saying? I'm just, I feel like, I, okay. I'm saying that I feel like we're in a little bit of a rut. And I feel like that I'm not flourishing. <laughs> That's funny. Well, far be it from me to keep the flower of you from flourishing. I guess I'll grab my shit and stay at Charlie's. Well, wait, don't do that. I mean, I I feel like I'm the one that got us into this mess. Okay, so you'll stay at Charlie's then. No. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Give me that again. Okay, so you'll stay at Charlie's. No. I can't. <laughs> I, no, you should stay there because you, you you already said that you would. And I and I and also I have more stuff and it's gonna take me longer to pack and I think it just it'll be easier so you should, yeah bing bong what is, who was that police officer hi I'm responding to a missing person missing persons report <laughs> I'll pack my things 